What happens if you stay overnight in Japan's most problematic capsule hotel? We have one rule. We can't leave no matter what happens. As we first stepped in, we were amazed how good it looked. This is crazy. I've seen this on the YouTube thumbnail somewhere. There was a huge hallway with capsules lined up on each side. And while these capsules seemed nice at first, I quickly realized how small they really were. Each one was the size of a coffin. And all we had was a bed and a pillow. These beds were so thin that you could feel the board. On the bright side, this place had some of the fanciest bathrooms I've ever seen. There was a huge desk area Area with an outdoor balcony and even the most advanced toilet I've ever used. But that didn't prepare us for the night, where we had to stay completely silent or we would get kicked out permanently. There were shoes all over the floor and the walls were paper thin. Someone was snoring so loud that we didn't even get a minute of sleep. So loud. But did we make it? Tap right here to watch the full video to see